you have a good night? Yeah? Uh, come on, have you a good night? Okay. Uh, well, wow, someone really has had a good night. <laughs> um, well, I have one more song to do for you guys. And uh, before I do this song, I, I just really want to thank you guys again. Um, thank First Baptist here for allowing me to come in. Margaret, thank you so much for everything you did uh, behind the scenes. And, and thank you all for showing up. <laughs> like, this, I'm so new at this being, um, for lack of a better word, my full-time job. <laughs> and so, to be able to stand in front of a group of fellow believers and just kind of share my heart and just share a part of my story um, and just a piece of who I am is just such so refreshing and it's really, really um, what keeps me going. So, so thank you guys for being such an encouragement uh, to me tonight. Um, I'm reminded every time I do this song of the truth that we find in Lamentations that God's mercies are new every morning. That it doesn't matter what we did yesterday or what we did 10 years ago or, thank goodness, not anything I did my first couple of years of college. <laughs> His mercies are great enough and new enough to cover that and, and to make me new and, and to make me fresh. But at the same time, it makes us real. Like, I, I encourage you as you leave tonight um, to own the areas in your life that you're broken. Because people will see that and people will resonate with that. And the way you act in spite of those moments is what shows people we as Christians are different. It's not showing